Well, hello everyone, and welcome back here to Don't Starve. It is day 13. We are going to be expecting the dogs in a day or two, so that's, uh, well, that's not really as much of a problem as it used to be. Somebody pointed out to me in the comments that um, this grass won't grow because it's not being fertilised. You are absolutely right, but uh, I wanted to fertilise the bushes first. Ooh, didn't want to do that. Okay, so today we're going to do some more preparation for winter. Let's have a quick look at the map. Okay, so we've explored down south. We've explored up north. And we've yet to find any uh, beef, uh, muffalo. Muffalo? No, that's Rimworld. Beefalo. <laughs> There's too many lows in, in the gaming world at the moment. Uh, it doesn't appear to be much east, but actually we might... Yes, I think we'll probably explore to the east today, I think. Uh, one of the other things I want to do is go pay my respects at the spiders, because I want one more piece of... Uh, uh, spider spider silk because I want to go fishing where is it down there I um I appreciate that the cursor doesn't exactly point in the right location there seems to be a bug with OBS when playing certain games and there's nothing I can do without it at the moment I do apologize but uh, I hope you guys will put up with it so there we go right we're going to go visit the spiders we'll do a bit of exploring and if we have time, we will construct a fishing rod and head down here. Reasons why I want to go fishing are, well, let's face it. After all the rabbit we've been eating, a different food source would be nice. But there's also the fact that um, naughtiness is going to become an issue fairly soon. Uh, naughtiness is what happens when you do things like... Uh, you gonna let me plant you there? You gonna let me plant you there? Wonderful. All right. Naughtiness, naughtiness is what happens when you do things like uh, kill rabbits or other animals, and it's a scale that uh, mounts up. And eventually, where are we going? Yeah. Okay. Eventually, what will happen is um, the Krampus will be summoned. The Krampus is not something I really want to deal with at the moment. It's rather viciously powerful monster which uh, attacks your base and steals your stuff and I don't have much stuff to steal so that doesn't really appeal to me that much. Uh, fishing however is not naughty. Hmm. Fishing in someone else's water possibly is but that's not something we have to deal with. So... Ooh, are we gonna have to deal with that? Yes I think we are. Right, let's leave that there. Right. Let's get through these eyes. Just clear them out a bit. Uh, let's kill this off, get it out of the way. There we go. Pick up the fleshy bulb and the leafy meat. The stale honey, for some reason, it must have. Oh, I don't know. Oh, um, we must have. Um, we must have eaten a bee or some or something like that. I don't know. Okay, let's make a trap and let's put that down here. And hello, Mr. Spider. That's it. If you pop into the trap. That was stupid of me. I forgot to equip the uh, the weapon first. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, I didn't need it in the long run. Come on, off you go. Can I make another? No, I need a bit more grass to make another trap. Come on, out the way. All right, we're gonna have to do this the hard way, are we? Okay, right, that didn't quite work out as I wanted, but...
still, we do have our second piece of silk, which will do nicely. Thank you very much. Uh, leave that for now. We've got what we wanted. Let's move on. Uh, we'll come back later on and make a fishing rod. But in the meantime, let's do a bit more exploring and let's see what we can find. Uh, important things are... Um, Our, our basic resources. We still need a load of the uh, uh, petals, rather, because we are still somewhat short of those, and we've got a lot of stuff to fertilise. So, oh, I've got some. Okay, so thank you very much. I have some time to do a little bit of walking around, so I'm going to suggest we do it. Get some more resources. And then we'll head back. Make ourselves a fishing rod for tomorrow, and tomorrow we'll go off fishing. And hopefully that will give us some fish sticks. Much, much needed fish sticks. How's our sanity doing? Right, our sanity's back to full. Uh, which is an important thing. That spider nest is starting to get a bit larger, which is good, because as you saw, we've got more spiders out of it. And... Yeah, all in all, we're, we're, we're not hurting for resources right now, which is a great thing. Where are we going? Okay. Um, nearly dark, so when we get there, we'll light a fire. Plenty of pine cones to do that with. Okay. Um, store some of this stuff. That won't go in there. Okay. Um, the carrots will. The seeds will. There we go. Let's go and grab some of these bunnies. We still have a little time to do so. Okay. That one's going to need replacing next time. Um, let's be a little bit naughty, shall we? Okay. Naughtiness goes down naturally, and if you can avoid being naughty, eventually you'll be nice. Uh, oh, getting dark. The rest of those can wait till morning. There we go. All right. And look at that! All that stuff. Uh, one of those is turned into rot. That's great. Oh, we can probably store that honey. We can eat this. No, that was much needed, and let's make ourselves up our next meal. So, see what happens. Can't put that in there. Okay. Don't have any monster meat, do we? And no, we didn't pick up any monster meat. So we'll do some berries and carrots there. There we go. That'll get the next set of meatballs cooking. All right, marvelous. Okay. Um, kill the wabbit. Yeah, burn the pine cone. Um, is it food or survival? I can never remember which. Bee box, farm, farm. So it must be survival. Okay. Bread trap. Eating cell. Straw roll. Fair old tent. Fishing rod. There we go. That is fantastic. We now have a new tool. Let's grab this rot. And let's get some more of these bushes up and running. Uh -huh. And oh look, these are starting to give us some dividends. Okay, we've got two more bushes. Stick one there. Stick one there. And by some strange coincidence we have two more pieces of rot. So, if you fertilise in these, there we go. Make sure we don't have the shovel equipped, because let's face it, the last thing we really want to do is dig these bushes up after we've gone through all the effort of getting these working. So, right, that worked well. Um, a little 
little bit of bunny murderage on the way through. Oh yes, let's get some grass because we really need it. And let's just check where that pond is. Uh, okay, so right, just basically south of us. Okay. That's good. Okay, we've got enough for another, another trap. It's good. We're going to need a lot of traps very soon because the traps that we've got are getting old. Right. A little bit of wood would be good at the moment. Wood would be good. Wood would be good. Uh, okay, yep, south of here. Marvellous. But I don't really have time to do that at the moment. I want to go fishing. And anyone who's ever gone fishing knows the thing you need most when fishing is lots and lots of time. Okay, any froggies? No? Okay, so let's see if we're going to remember this. So fish. And hook. Read in. Yes! Fishy! Fish. Apparently this gets a little bit longer after each fish is caught. Which makes sense, really. Look, read in. Yeah. That's two. And fish can be cooked in the crock pot or dried. Um, there's a few different recipes that can be used for it. The interesting thing is they can also be used as a replacement for meat in a lot of recipes as well. So fish is really versatile. And I'm glad we found this one pond. Uh oh. Okay, right, he's going to be trouble. Let's deal with him. Oh, I keep on doing that the wrong way round. Stupid me. Okay, and... Right, let's go and get ourselves some frog eggs as well. Right, okay, that worked out quite well. Uh, no, that went wrong. Let's... Yeah, get in the right slot. There we go. Right, don't have time for this. Okay, so there's a spear. Let's re equip the fishing rod. And. Let's fish! Fish! And. Let's see what we get. Well, we're gonna get a fish, hopefully. It's just. This is really, really exciting. Um, to watch, I should imagine. I do apologise, this is a bit boring. But, however, I think we're going to be able to get two fish sticks out of what we've got. Which is going to help heal us an awful lot. That's about 80 points of health. Oh, come on. Here we go again. And, of course, we're getting plenty of frog legs out of this as well. I would destroy you! We're getting there slowly. How are we doing for health? 38. Okay, not great, but I think we'll survive. Alright. We're doing for time. Not too bad. I think we'll get one more piece of fish. fish. There we go. I wonder. Um, uh. Oh, okay, that's how it works. Right. Boards. Oh, very nice. Won't object to those at all. Okay, it's getting dark though. Let's head back up. Right, okay, so five fish, two frogs legs and some boards. I would say that was a productive day. Uh, and this is the road back to camp, so we might as well get on it so we move a little faster. <laughs> um, right, reset the trap. Kill the wabbit. Uh, I had a 
feeding these were going to be a bit used. How are we doing for time? We've still got plenty of time. Okay, let's get another trap. I know you're so hungry, but plenty of food coming your way. Let's hope this doesn't summon the Krampus because I'm really not in the position to deal with that right now. Okay. And another trap. How are we doing for time? Right, this is the last one. Get the others in the morning. Let's get some stuff on the fire. There we go, that'll see us going. Uh, harvest the crock pot. Let's eat that. Okay, and let's make some food. Um, open this as well. There we go. Brilliant. Alright, so we'll put in two fish, um, a carrot, and some sticks. There we go. Get that cooking. There's berries there. Okay, and we'll put that out to rot. Okay, that's fantastic. That was that was a good a good day all told to be totally honest with you. How's this doing? So we'll harvest the drying rack. Put that one to dry. We'll probably need to um, do the other one in the morning. So as resources go, I think we're getting pretty pretty well off. That's dried as well, marvellous. Oh, didn't we eat that? Okay, never mind. Uh, fish sticks! Okay, so... Put that away, harvest that. Eat our fish sticks. Oh, that's giving us a nice big jump in our health. Let's make one more set of those. A nice healthy carrot and a stick because of course it's fish sticks so what would you expect get that one cooking right okay let's get everything out of these traps you can use your trap there I think So let's correct some of this grass all the way around. Uh, how much do we have left? We have a little bit of life left in that fishing rod, so we should go fishing again in a couple of days. Let's let that pond restock first. How are these looking? Stale, spoiled, and petals. Okay, so. Alright, so far. There we go. And those berry bushes are really starting to work for us now, which is great. Um, okay. Now. Oh. I can see I need... Let's, say, let's make ourselves one more trap. Put that down here. here um, survival I think it is bird trap bird trap would be very useful to us uh, when the winter comes around compass backpack pee bag healing self there we go that's what we're interested in okay so we need some charcoal okay well let's get ourselves some charcoal we need to go get some wood today anyway so So much for being good. But still, this is, even, this is giving us so many resources for later on. It's very hard to. The rabbits are just so easy to, to catch at the start. They are so useful. We'll have that. We'll make use of that later on. 
Uh, let's go find ourselves a decent tree. That, I would say, is a decent tree. end up with multiple axes. I don't know why. Uh, it's a flaw in my character, I should imagine. Um, have some of these stumps wobble at it as well. Each stump becomes a log. And logs are what we need here. I think I want about, I want about 20 or so logs at this point, to be honest with you. So... Oh, we're at nine, so we've got a little bit more to get. Oh, okay, that one collapsed as I was cutting it down. Okay, uh, let's get that. Okay. Um... Right, in order to make the ash, what we're going to do is we're going to set fire to some saplings or similar. How are we doing? All right, 16, one more tree. Actually, might as well do this one. Okay, seems to be my data break tools. Have one of those as well. Right, okay. I think that'll probably do us for these. Yeah, it's got our tree quota back up again. Um, need a torch. Set that on fire. Uh, what else should we set on fire? Oh, there we go, another sapling that'll do nicely. Just need those to burn out now. And there's some ash. Uh, what should I get rid of then? Mm. Don't need those, there we go. Two loads of ash, just what we needed. Let's get back to base before it gets too dark. Plus, what's the point of wearing out these nice new hit points on these spiders? Yeah, we're going the right way. Alright. Oh good, more rot. Excellent. Okay, so... Alright, first off, let's get the fire going. And let's make ourselves a heating cell. Like that. We won't use that straight away because we've got the fish sticks, so we'll eat the fish sticks, and that's gonna get us that's gonna get us pretty much healed up. But as you can see the chest is full, so I wanna make us another chest. We've already got one set of boards, like that, and there we go. Oh no, I didn't mean to make a sign. Oh, silly me. Um, there we go. Uh, so we need to make ourselves another set of boards. Fortunately, we've got a lot of... of uh, chests. There we go. And we'll put that just there. Okay, and we can start sticking some stuff in there. Uh, heating cell, we don't need. Fleshy bulb, I don't even know what to do with that to be honest with you. Uh, what else can we do? Let's stick some pine cones in there for planting later on. That'll do us nicely. Let's pick up that rot. We'll use that in the morning. And uh, let's get ourselves some food going. Uh, 
Right, well, there we go, uh, ladies and gentlemen. 50, uh, day 15, not exactly a stellar day, but we did some new stuff. Uh, I think that's all we got time for right now, so I'm going to say uh, thank you for uh, thank you for watching, thank you for putting up for this so long. I've been Simon Parsons, this has been uh, Don't Starve. Thank you, and good night.